Okay, so before we get into this demo, I want to go ahead and announce the winner of my last little giveaway or give back, maybe I should call it. And Wendy Evans, you are the winner. Congratulations. So go ahead and email me your address and my email address is at the bottom of my description box and um, I'll go ahead and get your goodies out to you as soon as possible and you guys be on the lookout for these little give backs because they could pop up at any time and I don't know if you noticed but less than 20 people entered last time so those odds are pretty good okay so back to the demo hey guys welcome back okay so today's demo is a lush bath bomb and so what I thought that I would do um, for the next several videos is do a Christmas in July Lush series inspired by the um, the Australia Lush, um, online Lush, just, I don't know if it's online or um, in the stores too, I don't know. But um, anyway, on Instagram I've been seeing everybody's pictures of all these awesome Christmas bath bombs um, that they just released. And um, so I was like, okay, I don't know why I'm not using mine because they're my favorite ones and I've been hoarding them since Christmas. So let me go ahead and use up my stash. It's been, what, like seven months now? And I don't know what I'm waiting for because, oh, I just love them so much. Anyway, so um, this is Nevermind the Ballistics and it is a lime orange and I swear a little bit of peach, I think it said too. And this one to me um, smells like a sweet tart. Oh, it smells so, so good. Um, and this is a bath melt. The pink is a bath melt. It's cocoa butter bath melt. So, um, and this exact same colors as the yellow submarine that I did not too long ago. But anyway, um, let's go ahead and get it in the bathtub and see what it's going to look like. I haven't used this in so long. I kind of forgot what it looks like in the water. I know it takes the pink a good while to melt because it's not really a bomb. And what did I just say? You know, it's kind of old, so. But, um, yeah, I do remember that in this bath, I felt like I was slipping and sliding around a little bit because it is so, so soft and moisturizing. So, I'm really excited to do, um, to do a bunch of, of lush baths in a row because I just haven't done, haven't done a lot of lush lately. I just, the Christmas ones, they were just, they were right up my alley, I guess because they were sweeter. And of course this one's, you know, very, very fruity, so. Oh, and this one, um, it's just like the over and over bath bomb, except for that that's got the orange on the top instead of the pink. And, God, I meant to write down the scent description of that one to, um, to tell you guys before I came in here. But, um, it's, it's fruity too. And, you know, most of you guys probably know the scent of that one too. But, um, yeah, so there's another bomb that's very, very much like this one. And I think, I don't know if it was a Valentine's Day bomb or what, but I never have tried that one. Now, I've never had a roller, but I think that this is the same thing as that too, and so that looks really cool because I've never been able to get one of those. And I'm surprised it did that considering how old it is. But this water is turning a really, really pretty um, tangerine, I guess I would say, at least on that one side.
this is so, so bright. I don't know if it's picking up quite as bright through the camera. I can't really tell. It's really, really pretty. Oh, well, ah! <laughs> oh, well. It's really, really pretty. I don't remember. I've had, I don't know, three or four of these. I don't remember it doing quite, quite this much. Maybe I didn't pay attention or didn't really let it go this much. Maybe I just kind of threw it in there <laughs> and took my bath, but I don't know, it's cooler than I remember. Yeah, anyway, so this is my last one. <laughs> Yeah, the colors, they're exactly like Yellow Submarine. Doesn't smell anything like it though. Okay, it's almost, I don't want to say all fizzed out, all foamed out, it wasn't much of a fizzer, but um, yeah, so the water is like, what's that orangey tangerine color? Well, let's check out the bubbles. Not expecting it to have <laughs> much, yeah, if any. But, you know, that's what we do these for, to, um, to see. And so you'll know when I know. <laughs> yeah, that's going to be it. But you know, I mean, baths like this with the with a lot of melt and then a really, really soft and silky and moisturizing. A lot of times they don't have a lot of bubbles, and that's fine. It's just the way they're made. So it's it's really interesting. The ones that have a lot of moisture and that have bubbles kind of are just the perfect mixture. But um, yeah, this one is just going to be really, really, really nice and soft. So um, anyway, I'll see you in a minute and let you know how it was. So here's the tub after never mind the ballistics and there's just nothing left. I mean with all that um, bath melt it was just so slippery it all slid right down and there wasn't a lot of pigment or anything else like that to um, make any kind of a mess. So it was just a really nice bath. Um, I liked it just as much as I remember so um, you know maybe they'll come out again this next Christmas and um, I'll be able to pick up another one then. But anyway um, I have all the Lush links listed down below and of course I like to purchase off the UK site because um, they just seem to get here in better shape and of course with the kitchen there's a lot more to choose from. But anyway um, go ahead and stick around for the next few minutes and see if there's anything after this. See you later. Bye. All right, you guys, so in honor of my Lush Christmas in July series, I've got a little Lush to send out to somebody today, um, and all of you guys are probably going to know what all of these are, but I'm going to go ahead and um, give out a yellow submarine to somebody because I liked that one so much. Um, I don't know if a lot of y'all have this one yet, 
Um, I know a lot of people do, but I know that maybe some people don't. And this is a golden egg. Obviously, I know a lot of people love this. And I've had this one for a while, and I've been meaning to cocktail it with something, but I just don't know that I want that much shimmer on me. And it is the Honey I Wash the Kids scent. But I don't know that if I haven't used it yet that I'm going to use it anytime soon. So I think that one of you guys will enjoy that. And um, this is the Magic Mushroom Bubble Bar. And I've also had this one for a while. And it's just not going to be my favorite scent. So if I, again, if I haven't used that yet, then um, one of you guys will probably enjoy it more than me. But um, yeah, so that is what I have for you guys today. I appreciate you so much for sticking around to the end of the video. So just go ahead and comment below in the next 24 hours. And um, you might get this little stash. Thanks a lot. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.